Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a mega box of 2020 Panini Prism Football. This is random team break number 12, and we're giving away four of the draft day mixer, uh, four draft day mixer spots at the very end of this break. But as always, we're gonna do the break itself first. Big thanks to everyone here for making this happen. And there's all 32 teams right here. Let's roll it and randomize names and teams four and four eight times. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, maybe no respect then, eight. Logan, what's going on? Rogers, Logan's a Packers fan saying Rodgers isn't going anywhere. I mean, even after these statements earlier today, it's pretty clear he wants out. After eight, eight times for the teams. And eighth and final time after eight. Why couldn't the Raiders take this guy? Jamin Davis sounds pretty good. All right, here's the first half of the list right here. My Raiders took a tackle from Alabama. A pretty good tackle, but... But at the 17th pick. All right, so let's just print this out and rip this up. Yeah, sounds like a player the Raiders would need on defense. They're terrible, terrible defense. Although they did, I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. I think they got uh, they got the UCLA guard or tackle or whatever, Colton Miller, super early as well. So, so we got him, got him super early. So maybe I shouldn't be so surprised. Colton Miller got a second contract though, so. Yeah, but I agree. But he's gonna be a fine player, PJ. But they were they were suggest you know the analysts, the talking heads were suggesting that he would have probably would have been available with the Raiders' second round pick. I'm fine. It's just, I feel like the Raiders had more pressing needs elsewhere that they could have addressed. Right, Warren Lowe saying that this Jamin Davis guy's a monster. If you watch him in person, I feel like the Raiders would have been a nice choice there. Yeah, a lot of Alabama players on the Raiders, right? Last year, I feel like we drafted all like Clemson players. That Jamin Davis guy who just went to the Washington football team got a Darius Leonard comp on on uh, on NFL Network. Nice uh, Tua base card here. Muhammad, what's going on? Soccer? Question mark. You gotta be more specific than that. Are you asking about soccer breaks? Are you asking if I like soccer, which I do? I'm a Liverpool supporter. It's Aaron Jones, who might have a new QB, and Aeneas Williams. Nice one for the Cardinals, Greg. Yeah, safety would have taken. Safety would have been nice. Could have used an edge rusher. Yeah, we do soccer breaks, Muhammad, but we don't have any at the moment. 
But always look on jazbeescasebreaks.com. You never know when, when they'll appear. That, that's what must have happened, Mike Tower. Someone's like, we need tackling. And someone's like, all right, a tackle. Gotcha. And a Justin Herbert in the box, too. Nice. It's Green Pulsar, Marquise Brown. And there's the Justin Herbert going out to the Bolts. That will be where the Chargers on my list. That's Mike Tower. That's you, Mike. There you go. All right, and there you have it. Now, let's see who's going to win those uh, draft mixer spots. 19 boxes, really good stuff, a lot of great giveaways. Let's grab everyone's names from Greg down to Brian. There's some new dice. There is a new list. And let's roll it and randomize that list three times. So it's going to be top four after three are in the mixer. One, two, and three. After three times... Now, from five on down. Sorry, Brian. Sad times there. But happy times for the top four who are in the mixer. Michael Hughes, Clayton, Zachary, and Brandon. Congrats to the four of you. You are in that 19-box mixer. We're going to break a little bit later tonight. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.